In this session, we'll focus on the geometric layout of a typical roadway design. We'll begin by setting up our coordinate system. We'll then attach various disparate forms of data. In this case, we have a DWG survey. With our data imported, we can now begin setting up a save view to allow us to work more efficiently. With our save view in place, we can apply it. Every project will be faced with constraints. In this project are geometric layouts constrained by tying into existing roadway features. In addition, because of the layout of the site, we're going to try to hold our design or our geometric layout to the lower portion of our site. In this design, these constraints are depicted by the three white rectangles on our screen. So to begin with, we'll bring in survey geometry of the existing roadways. With the geometry imported, we can begin tying into these alignments.
With our geometric components in place, we can store the geometry. Prior to storing the geometry, we'll choose a feature. Our alignments created with that notation and we're ready to create the remaining portions of our layout including the edge of pavement, the intersection,